Hello and welcome to Trust News Summary. I am Ayuba Ilya. Thank you for joining. Here's the news in brief. The ruling All Progressives Congress on Monday screened 12 of the 23 aspirants seeking its presidential ticket to compete with candidates of other political parties in 2023. They appeared before the screening committee at the Transcop Hilton Hotel in Abuja. Those screened on Monday included the national leader of the APC and former governor of Lagos State, Bola Ahmed Tinubu, Ebony State Governor David Umahi, and Jigar State Governor Badaru Abubakar, among others. The prelate of the Methodist Church, Nigeria, has His Eminence, Reverend Samuel Kanu, has regained freedom from his abductors. The prelate was released with two others seized with him 24 hours after the abduction. The abductors had demanded 100 million naira ransom for their release, but it was unclear if the church paid ransom or not for them to regain freedom. Police operatives in Zamfara State have arrested a suspect for culpable homicide and been in possession of human part. Zamfara State Police Command spokesman Mohammed Shehu said in the statement that the suspect was arrested by the Joint Police and Military Operatives on anti-banditry operation along Dauran Zurmi axis. Away from Nigeria, the U.S. National Hurricane Center says Agata, the first hurricane to, to form in the eastern Pacific this year, made landfall just west of the Mexican resort town of Petru of Puto Anjo and is expected to dump torrential rains as it moves deeper on land. Category 2 Agata is moving northeast at 13 km per hour with maximum sustained winds of 165 km per hour. And that's a wrap on Trust News Summary. Connect with us via all social media platforms and also subscribe to our YouTube channel to watch more. I am Ayuba Ilya. Thank you for watching.